The game was going really quickly because that's what happens when you Cliff Lee starts a game. There was nothing going on. The Phillies weren't scoring. Honestly, we were a little like waiting for something to happen. And then my sister uh, leaned over and said, I just got a text message from my aunt. Uh, and it just said Bin Laden was killed. It kind of like reverberated through the stadium, but like almost person to person. All of a sudden, the guy next to me uh, just jumps out of his seat and yells, oh my god, we got him. He's dead. And you can see, obviously, with their Blackberries or iPhones, the news is spreading. This huge news, historic news, had been taking place, and all these people in Philadelphia were at the ball game, finding out over their phones. You started hearing some USA chants. And those USA chants just started to spread. I joined in, I jumped up on my chair and started chanting USA and jumping up and down. a wave. 45,000 people panic. You see Ryan Howard looking around and you just wish somebody could have yelled to them like what was going on. I was in the middle of the inning. I just heard uh, chanting of USA and I think the hitter stepped out and we were trying to figure out what was going on. We went out to the mound for a conference out there. We all looked at each other and said, does anyone have any idea what's going on right now? Why, why are they saying USA? About everything went through my head except Bin Laden being killed. When I got down in the dugout after the inning, one of the paramedics showed me his phone with the, the news on it, and I, I just was said, let's finish the game tomorrow. <laughs> let's just celebrate and, and uh, think of all the men and women who lost their lives uh, trying to capture that man. And there was just this sense that the game had all of a sudden become irrelevant. I mean, it was 1-1, and at that point, I don't think anybody cared who, who won the game. It's a shame we lost the game in the 14th, but you know, it wasn't about the team who won or lost then, it was about what happened. It was fantastic. It just goes to show you how people and the fans here in Philadelphia see things. And also it goes to show you that life and everything is bigger than baseball and the game in some ways.